the following contest is scheduled for one fall and is a six-man tag team action match. About to make their way to the ring, being led by Scott Demore. They are Team Canada. Well, there's no question in my mind. The team captain, Petey Williams, leading the way. His partners, Showtime Eric Young second. The third wrestler, Bobby Roode. They played an important in-ring role in the America's X Cup, in the World X Cup. But so much of the heat, so much of the friction, and quite honestly, so much of the disgust with Team Canada centers on just one individual. And you're looking right at it. The overbearing loudmouth, the coach Scott DeMore. I am sick of him. First of all, from Mexico City, Mexico, this is Heavy Metal! The problems with Team Canada coach Scott DeBoer not just limited to members of the U.S.-based Team NWA, like the captain Jerry Lynn, Heavy Metal of Team AAA, the victim of a post-match beatdown last Wednesday by Team Canada and looking for revenge. From Guadalajara, Mexico, He also has a mutual dislike for Scott Demore and the Canadians. And introducing representing Team NWA, this is Chip. Well, here he goes. Gary Morris couldn't even finish introducing Gary Lynn as he comes in bringing the NWA flag and goes right at him. And they've got Bobby. They've got Bobby Roode right now, three on one. You saw Jerry Lynn charging to the ring. Connects with the head scissors on Root and wait a minute, turning his attention to Scott DeMore who oh. jumps over the safety rail. Oh, he wants Scott DeMore bad. Oh, I mean, that's somebody that he, he would love to get bad. his hands on. You know, we, Don, Don, think back just three weeks ago when Lynn had the five minutes in the ring with DeMore. DeMore and Root double teamed Lynn and cost Jerry his chance at payback. Well, oh, I just want to see Lynn get his hands on DeMore. That guy in the ring right there, Showtime Eric Young, came in and cost Jerry Lynn. He had him in the cradle pile driver, getting ready to finish him off. And again, Team Canada came in and foiled it, as you see. Hector Garza right there, just giving it to Eric Young. Well, at least we've had some light shed on the situation later tonight for the new NWA World's Heavyweight Champion, Jeff Jarrett. Now we know what Triple Jeopardy's all about. Don't forget, we've also got AJ Styles later tonight going for this third X Division Championship against the champ. Kazarian, as you see, heavy metal take a fall as he misses coming off the ropes. Receiving word through my headsets from Vince Russo, the director of authority, that in the Barrio strap match tonight involving Conan and Jeff Jarrett, that you win the match when you whip your opponent ten times. Wow. Three matches, three separate opponents, three separate stipulations for the new champ as we see. Petey Williams, Team Canada captain, and heavy metal both crashed down to the floor. I'll tell you what, there is no love for Team Canada from either Team Mexico or Team NWA, and that's why they've joined forces here today. Every time it seemed like Scott Demore would bring that flag in, connect with the hockey stick, and somehow find a way to use it any time that Team Canada got victory. But, you know, think about it, Jerry Lynn is not even in the ring. Jerry Lynn went off chasing Scott Demore, and he's not even in the ring right now. I don't even know if he's in the building. Garza in heavy metal. Going to try and turn it around against the Canadians. Now, Don, I'm getting word. We have TNA cameras outside. We understand that Sanjay Dutt is approaching Raven. We'll bring you that situation at the conclusion of this match. We've got the tape machines rolling. We don't want to break away live from this match, but we will update that situation involving Sanjay Dutt and Raven at the conclusion of this six-man tag team matchup. Actually turned into a five-man yeah. tag, hasn't it? Yeah, With Jerry, Jerry Lynn leaving. Oh, oh Hector Garza went out over the ring. Heavy metal went flying over the ring. But right now, though, you got to look at it. Hector Garza and heavy metal, like oh, you just said. look at this. Take a look oh. at your monitor. Oh, Scott DeMore. What, what's he coming in? He's so proud of himself. Almost like he just took care of Jerry Lynn. Look oh, at him. Jerry Lynn. And he's got him. And he's got him in the ring. Now it's time to oh. get the payback. Oh, Scott DeMore bailing as quick as he can. Oh, Jerry Lynn preoccupied with Scott DeMore. 
Let's Bobby Roode get in there and blindside him. That's really the problem. You've got to remain focused on the task at hand, and you can't blame Jerry Lynn. No. Everything that he's gone through, the repeated knocks, all the doubters claiming that he shouldn't be the captain of Team NWA. Well, first, he brings the United States to the World X Cup victory, and now he wants to silence personally and physically his most outspoken critic, oh, Coach Gamora. Yeah. Bobby Roode using a sprint right there, applying the boot right to the neck. I mean, this international team here of, of heavy metal and Hector Garza and Jerry Lynn. Jerry Lynn's got to get focused. He's got to get focused on the match at hand. He can worry about Scott DeMore afterwards, but right now he's got to help out heavy metal and Hector Garza. And, and Bobby Roode has not allowed him to do that as he's just applying the pressure right there on the neck and the head. Look at this. Oh, look at this. Using his force and boom, right into the ring post. Charges and sends Jerry Lynn back first into the turnbuckles. You know, I see the six-sided hexagon ring. Provides more options to use high-risk offense in these X Division matchups. A standard four-sided ring, it's 18 feet between the ring posts. The six-sided ring is only 12 feet. The shorter span between the posts, as we see Williams go for a pin, it allows for more spring. Oh, off look at the here, Scott DeVore, look at this. Oh, come on. Are you surprised? Not at all. What a snake. You know, you talk about MVPs in these X Cup competitions. You talk about the U.S., I think of a Chris Saban, I think of a Jerry Lynn. Many times you've pointed out the MVP of Team AAA, Hector Garza. Oh, absolutely, no doubt about it. What about Team Canada? What's the MVP? Who's the MVP been for Team Canada? I'll tell you who the MVP of Team Canada's been. It's been the hockey stick with the flag on it. You're right, that That's flag, what they keep using. That flag draped hockey stick that they continue to use as a weapon. Now we see one captain against the other. Canada's Williams shoots Lane into the corner, but Jerry was ready for him. Potty with the drop toe hole. Petey Williams, I, I gotta be honest with you, Jerry Lynn goes for it, but Petey Williams is ready in ducks. I gotta be honest, Team Canada would be easy to like. I mean, you, know, you admire what Petey Williams has done, Bobby Roode have done, and even so time Eric Young. But the Scott DeBoer factor just turns you away from Team Canada. You can't even look at their ability when you think of Scott DeBoer. Look to me like Petey Williams may have been trying to attempt that awesome finishing move, that Canadian destroyer, that flip pile driver. It certainly was reversed by Lynn. Tag is in, and here comes Team AAA and Mass Garza and Heavy Metal both accepted the tag. Now they came in and just cleaned house right away as they took out Eric Young and Bobby Roode, and now they sit him in the middle for a little meeting of the minds. Ooh, what a blow there by Heavy Metal. And again, look how these guys are, they're, I mean, these guys were the X Cup champions twice. They know how to work together. Oh, and Bobby Roode, oh, Heavy Metal caught him. Look at Bobby Roode, oh, 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 outside of the ring. Moonsaulted Don from the side of the ring all the way down to the arena floor on Showtime, Eric Young. Focus back in the ring. Bobby Roode has got Heavy Metal gonna try and take him up. Went for a Canada bomb, his oh. power bomb attempt. Heavy lands on his feet. Nice elbow shot by Heavy Metal. He sets up and he's he got Roode. Oh, he was so close and Petey Williams just gets in there and die. Heavy went for the bridging suplex. Team Canada Captain Williams in to make the save. Now the captains go one on one. Lynn and Williams. Nice double leg gonna try and catapult him here. What's he gonna do? Try to get a grip? Yeah. Oh, oh. It sends Petey Williams all the way outside. Great move there by Jerry Lynn. Using his momentum to get Petey Williams out. Heavy oh, metal's got Bobby Roode in the ring. Jerry Lynn outside chasing after Damore. Petey Williams. Well, he knew he had to stick it up again. Using it again, and he brings it in on Heavy Metal, and now Bobby Roode's got him. Hockey stick to the back. Bobby Roode takes Heavy Metal up. Oh, my gosh. The Canada Bomb Power Bomb. And it goes. Got the pin. The winner to the match, Team Canada. Because of why? Yeah. Hockey stick offense from Team Canada and Coach Gamore. Oh, look at this. Oh, now humiliating. Oh, come on. Oh, come on. Putting it over like a shroud. He's burying Heavy Metal, so to speak, in, oh. the, Can in the Canadian flag. And Oh, he took offense to that. He just, Hector Garza has been about one thing, and that's been about class and sportsmanship. And he just saw that as a total disrespect to his profession. But the numbers are just too much for Hector Garza. But wait a minute. Here comes Jerry Lynn. Oh, he's got the NWA player. And he's letting him have it. One after the other. Now it's time to get the more. Oh, he's got him. Scott DeMore, look at this, no. 
Oh, come on, he says, you really haven't seen that before. Oh, yeah, listen to this crowd. Oh, come on. He's got him. Take this big load off. Oh, 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 yeah, what he was going to take time. him up with a cradle pile driver. P.D. Williams cut him off. Oh, now look at the more getting his licks in. Oh, Jerry Lynn was so close to having redemption right there. So close to having restitution. Oh, wait a minute. Look at this. Scott DeMore ripping the NWA flag. Oh, come on. He's tearing it to shreds. Just ripping it pieces. Here comes right there. Chris Saban, that was more than they could handle. Think of everything that Team USA, Team NWA accomplished in the World X Cup, and DeMore has the guts to try and tear the NWA flag to shreds. Oh, look at Tabor. Always finds a way to get out of, out of harm's way, doesn't he? So close to being driven in by Jerry Lynn. Petey ah, Williams but... bails him out. Oh, oh, they are man. the winning team. And before we hear from the NWA World's Heavyweight Championship, Jerry, this is what went down just moments ago at the remote location involving Sanjay Dutt and Raven. We had the tape machines rolling. Let's go to that tape right now.